you thanks well in your health news this morning our excrement might be one of our best hopes to quickly detect coronavirus outbreaks that's because the disease can quickly be identified in feces even before coronavirus tests so senior international correspondent Fred Pleitgen talks to German researchers in Leipzig who are testing wastewater to detect the virus Believe it or not, our excrement might be one of our best hopes to quickly detect coronavirus outbreaks. That's because the disease can be detected in feces even before people get coronavirus tests. German research institutes and some public works like here in the city of Leipzig are right in the middle of a massive trial. The hope? Locating new outbreaks fast by finding the virus in wastewater. If it would be possible to have an idea of the concentration of coronavirus in the wastewater, we can calculate the number of infected people in Leipzig. And this would be very interesting in the coronavirus uh, strategies. Germany is among several countries experimenting to see whether sewage could be a COVID-19 early warning system. Researchers found out very early on during the pandemic that indeed COVID-19 can be traced in feces. But now the big question is, can that be done on a regular automated basis? And can it be done in a large area, like for instance, an entire country? The biggest problem, finding even small traces of the virus in a lot of sludge like this. The renowned Helmholtz Center for Environmental Studies, virologist René Kallis is trying to do just that, aiming to extract parts of the virus's genome, called the RNA, from large samples of sewage. We have a high, high volume of, of um, wastewaters, and I think it's a challenge to find the, the traces of the virus in the wastewaters. So we have liters, um, and we have to scale it down to microliters to get a sufficient amount for RNA extraction. Um, I think that's a challenge, yeah. If they succeed, in the future, sudden spikes of coronavirus in samples from certain sewage plants could tell authorities where new outbreaks are happening and allow them to quickly react, one of the heads of the study tells me. It would be the, the first test line, actually. Well, it would start with, with our measurement, and then you would know where to go uh, to look for, for the reasons. With that knowledge, authorities could then initiate targeted testing for those areas to quickly contain outbreaks. The scientists say their model could be ready for deployment if and when the next wave of the novel coronavirus hits. I think uh, we, we can offer something before the next wave, actually. So if, if, if the next wave is coming in, in fall or early winter or so, uh, then we should have something. The scientists acknowledge they still have a long and difficult way to go, but they are confident they might indeed find a way to make feces into a natural coronavirus alarm. Fred Pleitgen, CNN, Leipzig, Germany.